Well, good evening, YouTube. I hope this video finds you well. I was having a little trouble sleeping, so I figured I'd um, just keep making videos. <laughs> yeah, this one's sort of a bummer. So, sorry about that. You know, but reality checks, history lessons, they usually are. So, for all you sons and daughters of the Republic, this is something they're not teaching the kids in school anymore. It's something most people my age learned in school, but most have forgotten. That if you are a male in this country between the ages of 15 and 45, well, we can bump that up now to 55 technically because we're living longer, we're stronger, and most 55-year-olds are abled, able-bodied men. Yep, so if you're a male in this country between the ages of 15 and 55, you, whether you like it or not, are the militia. That's right, you are the militia. You don't have to be a member of a group. You don't have to be out there training every weekend or once a month because you're a male in this country between the ages of 15 and 55. You are the militia. And um, because you're part of the militia, you're going to be considered a combative. You know, and it does not matter if it's a uh, civil war or a third world war, if we're invaded by Russia or China. You are the militia. You're combative. Yeah. You know how they're dealt with. Civil war breaks out which is starting to look more and more likely like it's going to, at least my own personal belief. And I don't think the left has uh, detention camps or uh, prison camps all set up for uh, <laughs> for prisoners. So when they start kicking in doors and dragging people out, if you're a male between the ages of 15 and 55, most likely you're going to get one in the head. right sorry it'd be a buzzkill told you it's gonna be a reality check remember you know if you are a male between the ages of 15 and 55 if you think I'm not gonna get involved I don't even care about politics you know I don't care if you're left wing right wing independent you are going to be considered a combative. You are going to be considered part of the militia, whether you like it or not. Man, you need to stop preparing. There's no way, no way you're going to survive on your own. Think, oh, I'm just going to take my wife and kids, go hide out in the mountains by myself. If you don't have a uh, group, you don't have... Um, men backing you up able-bodied men you know if you're just sitting at your house waiting for shit to happen and your door gets kicked in it's not going to be good they drag you out of the house they're just saving your wife from cleaning the carpet get it through your heads shit's getting real Got to prepare. Got to train. Whether you like it or not. Time to start walking. Then jogging. Better start hitting the floor. Doing some sit-ups, push-ups. So whether you like it or not. Combatives. Militia. Only gonna be dealt with one way. Yeah. Sorry. All right, guys. Ponder that for a little while. Think about what I'm saying. Call me a wackadoodle all you want. 
I honestly been paying attention to politics my whole life. And uh, don't like what I'm seeing. Don't like what I'm seeing one bit. Don't like seeing where it's going. In my own personal opinion, I think it's unavoidable. I think the Democrats, they've been pushing and pushing and pushing. And it'll be a miracle, in my opinion, if we don't fall into full-fledged, all-out, blood-in-the-streets civil war. Need to know where you stand. Remember, guys, 1555, combative. Yeah. Talk to you guys later.